Hi friends, it's Deanna Willison from Our Blooming Catholic Life. And as you can see, I've already opened a new package today. Um, it kind of exploded a tiny bit when I opened it. So do be careful of that. I will warn you if you get it. Um, what is it? Okay, first of all, it comes with this cute little newsletter from Pauline Books and Media. Media. Um, the Daughters of St. Paul included some other recent publications with little samples. The cello at Interra people are going crazy for, I know. Um, I've seen all my friends just adore it. And here we have some other books by Pope Francis. When I say books, um, they are apostolic exhortations. So what did I get? I got the encyclical letter of the Holy Father Francis on fraternity and friendship for Telly Tutti. And as you may know, or maybe you don't know, if you get encyclicals from the Daughters of St. Paul, they're a small little book, so they can easily fit in your purse or bag. They're nice little, see, I mean, just the same size as my hand. So pretty small books here. They do use the Vatican translation. They tell you that right away. So that is great to know. The contents, it's a little confusing because it's like Fratelli Tutti, one, without borders, two. And then it talks about these chapters. It has subheaders. It gives the page numbers. And I want you to remember, friends, when you're reading an encyclical, the page numbers refer to this particular edition you hold in your hand. The actual document doesn't have page numbers per se. So if you are ever going to refer to this, you're going to need, see in front of the paragraph is a little number. They're not actually called paragraph numbers. They're called section numbers because sometimes it can be one number for several paragraphs. These are not, these are each for one paragraph. Of course, it's going to make me look silly, but just trust me, friends, you're going to find there's actually a special symbol that you use. It's kind of like two S's one, uh, joined together and that is the section symbol. Um, you can find that on your keyboard. Sometimes you have to go into insert and you'll find the section symbol in there. Um, also to note, if you have something that's a quote, like here, the Christian tradition has never recognized the right to private property as absolute or inviolable and has stressed the social purpose of all forms of private property. And you're like, what? But that is a quote. So you're going to want to look. And where do we find that? Footnote here. And then they are true footnotes, they're not endnotes, so they're right here. Um, in the document itself, if you're reading the document itself on the Vatican website, they are endnotes. They're at the very end of the encyclical on the website. But in here, they're going to be footnotes. So I can see where he's quoting this from. He's actually quoting himself from his encyclical letter, Laudate C. Si. And so it gives you all of the information there. And that is going to be, I guess, in section 93. So interesting that he's quoting himself, but still. Um, and so this is, it looks like it's just the encyclical itself. Let's see. Yeah, this is just straight up the encyclical. I'm not seeing any commentary. I really wasn't sure when I ordered it um, if it was going to have any. I don't see any commentary. Sometimes I know the Pauline sisters do have books with commentary, but this is looking straight up the encyclical itself. Um, a lot of people talk about how big it is. Um, and maybe that's part of why that could be part of why it's just the encyclical itself. And maybe down the road, they're going to come up with more of a study guide version, but this is straight up the encyclical right there. Um, yeah, so, oh, you're probably wondering then how many pages are the encyclical? It's 210 pages in in this little format. Remember the size of my hand. So that's it. That is the edition that you're going to get from Pauline Books and Midi Media on Fraternity and Friendship for Telly 2T. Thanks.